Hey guys, today Apple has finally officially released the first public beta for iOS 26. And I know a lot of you guys were looking forward to the first public beta. So today I'm going to show you how to install iOS 26 public beta one on your devices. Now keep in mind, this is still beta software. iOS 26 will not be fully available to the general public until perhaps mid September, 2025. So keep in mind that the software is still in beta and there could be bugs. So proceed with cautions. There's going to be a few bugs and issues until the official release. But without further ado, let me show you how to install the first public beta for iOS 26 on your devices. All right, so the link will be available in the description down below for Apple's public beta program. So it'll bring you here. Make sure you click the links in the description, open it within Safari. And right here it is. This is the public beta program. Now you want to scroll down and sign up. Now, once you click sign up, make sure you enter your credentials, right? And log in with your Apple ID and password, the same way you have on your iPhone or you can sign in if you've signed up for public beta programs before so if you've signed up before just sign in if you haven't just sign up so click on sign up or sign in and then log in with your Apple ID once you do it'll bring you to the next step which is obviously select the beta that you want to test which is iOS in this case scroll down and then right here says enroll your device so click on enroll your device and then you want to scroll down once again. And of course, you want to open the beta updates. It'll redirect you to settings. Make sure you select public beta. I have developer beta running on this iPhone, but you select the public beta, refresh, and then you'll be able to install iOS 26 on your device. So just keep in mind, you may also want to make sure you back up your device before you run iOS 26 beta. The software is running okay on most devices right now, but if something goes wrong, you wanna make sure that you back up your device before you try any of this. So going into settings here under iCloud and iCloud settings, make sure you perform an iCloud backup for your device if you're looking to install this beta. Now, another question that I get is, what's the difference between the public beta and the developer beta. Is there any features available for the public that are not available for developers? Or is there any features available on the developer beta that are not available for the public beta? And the answer to that is no, both betas are identical. The only reason this one's called public beta is because this comes a month and a half or two later after the developer beta was released in order for Apple to have some time to sort out some of the most critical bugs so that you don't have too many issues. But with that being said, there's still going to be some bugs until the official release in September. And even with official software, there's always bugs. So there you guys have it. iOS 26, the first public beta now officially available. This is how you install it. It's the same software that will be running available on developer end. So enjoy the software. Enjoy a lot of the new features. If you want to know what's new, links down below for all my coverage on the betas. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.